screaming in the woods, a very loud screaming. Call 911, we heard, my wife heard that. That's how he knew his neighbors on Hickory Kingdom Road were in trouble. The house, which is surrounded by a wooded area, is where a child was reportedly attacked by a bear Tuesday morning. I didn't know if the children were making up something and you know playing or if something real, so I decided to go over. He doesn't want to show his face no, on camera, but says he immediately sprang into action. He drove the short distance because he had a feeling a large animal could be involved. He was right. It was a bear. He also saw two very scared children trying to get away from it. I saw the children running down the hill into the house. The bear was circling the house, looking in the window. And when it went on the other side of the house, I drove out the driveway, went down the block a little bit, and there was another spot I could pull over, and it came back around. So it definitely followed the children into the house, trying to get into the house. With PIX 11's chopper was over the scene as North Castle officers searched the area. The guy loaded up, went in the woods. Within 10 minutes, I heard a gunshot. Space of about a minute, another gunshot, and the bear was dead. And then you saw them retrieve the bear? Yes, four officers picked it up in a, like a burlap and carried it out. Police have not shared details about the incident, but they spent the day guarding the house. A witness tells us the victim is a seven-year-old boy who was playing in the open backyard with a little girl. As for the neighbor, he describes the animal as a medium-sized black bear. Though he moved just a few days ago, he says he already knows bear sightings come with the territory. I'm going to be purchasing bear spray, keeping it uh, on my pants clipped on. God forbid it happens again. And if you have children, you definitely have to be prepared. We spoke to a relative as he was leaving the home. He says the family does not want to give any interviews about the terrifying incident, but says the child will be okay.